Hey guys, Goldbear back here today with another video. And today, guys, we are going to be reviewing some more Fortnite. I've seen in the past comments that you guys really enjoyed the Hasbro figures. And um, I figured I'd go out and buy some more uh, Hasbro Fortnite. Um, I'm really enjoying this line. I hope that uh, Hasbro makes more Fortnite figures. Um, I like to see a Durberger, a Mecha Team. I, I want to see a Mecha Team uh, figure. That would be amazing that that would just that would make my day right there i'm hoping they go back and make figures like that but anyways today is a little different we're not really reviewing a figure we are reviewing these arcade collection series uh things um also known as an arcade cabinet um and i only know that because i've been a fan of five nights at freddy's for too long and <laughs> Obviously, these would be good replicas if you were making a FNAF uh, layout or something. But let's open these up. Uh, here's the bat or side of the package. It can show you the arcade cabinet. These things look really good, cool. And I can't wait to open them up. At first, I wasn't going to buy them. But then I figured, well, my characters need some consumables. So, you know. And actually, these are what come in the arcade. So, you only get three things. But... The fact that you're actually getting an arcade cabinet is awesome. So let's get this guy or this thing open. Oh, they really, they really taped that. So I'm assuming that I don't really know how these things open. I'm hoping I can repurpose them too. Yeah, Hasbro's done a lot of unique packaging for these things. Actually, I think I could probably just get it out from the front side, so I'm not even going to worry about the top. If I can open it from the back, that is. Oh. I just ripped it. Well, that's all right. Wouldn't be a wouldn't be a gold bear video without a little ripped. But here is one of the arcade cabinets, and I'll get the other one open here so I don't have to waste any more of your time. Uh, put the box. This one comes with these three things. So pretty interesting that yeah, I'm, and I'm like. I'm thinking to myself, and I'm like, why didn't they just make vending machines? I mean, that probably would have been a lot more more unique for this. But at the same time, you're getting an arcade cabinet, so I guess it's not really that much of a loss. So I just found an easy way to open up the box with my X-Acto knife. So we'll move that to the side here, open this guy up. If I can get it out of the box, that is... These things are pretty awesome. I gotta say, I don't, I've been a fan of arcade games for too long that I should know. <laughs> Obviously, they they're really unique. Now, and I've watched reviews on these, and they actually have, you know, something in the back here that you can open up, and it's like a gun rack or something. But first, let's just take a look at detail here. You got the side here you got some people dancing like these look right out of the game too they're really cool i really like these things a lot um got Durberger here actually yeah they're called dance royale that's what they're called in the game they don't i don't think they ha they have like brand new arcade games now in fortnite chapter three just came out so let's open this up here and like i said there is a gun rack on the back here so you can actually open it up and then put it back in like that and then you got a gun rack on the back of your arcade machine which is i guess unique in its own way and what i found cool is i don't know if you can see that but they actually added like circuits in the inside that is just unique that is really awesome that they did a feature like that so let's see where did we get here I'll just grab my scissors so I don't have to take that off again. I think this one comes with the little ch 
chug or the little slurp juice thing and the two weapons. Now, I have noticed that the weapons are bent and it kind of sucks that they, they're like that. But the first one we got here is the, I think this is the Sculpt AR if I'm not wrong. But it's kind of bent there. You kind of could put it back in place a little bit, but. I probably won't be using these on my characters. I kind of just bought them for show. And then it comes with the uh, SM, just the, I think it's a mini SMG. I, I, it's an SMG of some sort. I don't remember which one it's called. And then it comes with the slurp juice, which this thing looks amazing. Now you actually can't like put it in the character's arm or not arm, hand, I mean. You could probably put it in the arm and make him like hold on to it from there. I was wondering if you could pop this top off, but you can't. But this is really cool. I mean, you can actually see, like, it looks like there's actually something in there, like Slurp. So that is really cool. I think, I really think they did a good job with this. I really do. It's really awesome. And there's actually some other detail on there that can't really tell what that is, but it, it's really cool. I You probably can stand yeah you can stand it up so that's awesome now let's see how i want to see how this gun rack works because it's just amazing I, I think it's just amazing that they they're doing this so you can take this right here and you put it on the back here like this and I'm assuming they just go on like so, and there you go, you got a gun rack. Now, obviously you can't do this and have it on the other side because they won't fit. I'll probably just put the guns back in the arcade cabinet anyways. I figured I'd bring my good old Chaos Agent down here to test how you would look playing the arcade game, but before we do that, I'd like to take a look at the other thing can hold the slurp juice that is well kind of anyways let's look at this one so this one also has i'm pretty sure also has a it does a gun rack so that's awesome and it has has this massive sniper man oh this is big <laughs> this is awesome this is and i'm i'm kind of sort of decent with the sniper now in fortnite so it's kind of relevant but and then you get two of these other consumables or whatever you'd like to call them and they are actually one is the boogie bomb and then the other one is the plunge the I know what it is. It's a plunger weapon. It's like the the plunger bomb. I OGs out there will correct me on this, but you guys know what it's called. I know what it's called. It's just not popping in my head right now. But unfortunately, you can't stick it to anything. But you can. There is this thing where you can move it up and down, and it's on a ball joint, I'm pretty sure. So technically, you could, like, put it up here or I, I i don't know you can make it look like it got stick stuck to some or uh, but it's pretty it's pretty cool i i do like this and i'm hoping they make more stuff like this maybe next time i'd prefer them to make like vending machines or something so we could have these are these are awesome just for display and you know McFarlane hasn't done something like this, but if you wanted to have like your character playing a game or something, you could have them. I'd probably do it right now. Try not to make this video too long, but well, you can't really. I guess you can, but that would be about as good as you can get it. As I didn't, I didn't mention before, but this one has uh, fish sticks on it, and the other one has bright bomber. But th that is the arcade cabinets by uh, Hasbro. Um, I hope to get the other figure soon if I can, and I will see you guys in the next video. So leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe for more. And yeah, so.
Peace out.